This right here is a piece of history. It's not some artifact from a bygone era. It's a JCB backhoe loader. More specifically, this is the 750,000th JCB backhoe loader. Laid nose to tail, 750,000 backhoe loaders would stretch more than 4 million kilometers. To put that into context, that line of backhoes would stretch around the world more than 100 times. Joseph Cyril Bamford and his team built the first JCB backhoe loader in 1953. It's interesting to note that the machine was conceived in the same year that Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II was crowned, and the reign of both continues to this day. It's impossible to overstate the importance of the JCB backhoe loader. It's a machine that sparked a mini industrial revolution, mechanising jobs that had previously been done by hand. The backhoe loader would become the mainstay of construction sites around the world for more than half a century. The machine has had songs written about it, and the term JCB has slipped into the global lexicon. It's become shorthand for all types of construction equipment. Say those three simple letters to someone with no connection to the construction industry, and this is the machine they will picture in their minds. The JCB backhoe loader has evolved, of course. The original Mark I machine and the Hydra digger that followed just three years later came in a blue and red livery. It was only in 1960, with the launch of the heavier, more powerful JCB-4, that JCB's signature yellow branding made its first appearance. The JCB-3 went into production in 1961, followed by the JCB-3C in 1963, and the JCB-3C-2 in 1967, a model that stood the test of time, staying in production for the next 13 years. 1980 marked another turning point. A £24 million investment spawned the JCB-3CX, a machine that has become a backhoe icon around the world. JCB now manufactures backhoe loaders here in the UK, in India, Brazil and also in the United States. In the field of construction, the backhoe loader is as important as the development of the printing press, the telephone and the personal computer. It made a multitude of construction tasks easier faster and less labour intensive and significantly safer. The fact that a single manufacturer has now produced more than three quarters of a million of these machines speaks to the ongoing significance of the backhoe loader. When that first machine rolled out of a shed in Staffordshire almost seven decades ago, nobody could have predicted it would change the construction industry forever. No one could have foreseen that it would become the foundation upon which a three billion pound global company would be built. No one could have imagined that the company would go on to produce 750,000 of the machines first conceived in the year man first conquered Everest. Or maybe one man did. Maybe Joe Bamford did. That is what visionaries do. And it's fitting that these machines still bear his initials to this day. <laughs>